In this video you will learn how to install the SolarEdge energy meter with Modbus connection. Let's have a look at what you'll find in the package. Before installing the meter, let's identify the meter interfaces. Located at the top left of the meter, the voltage phases socket. At the middle top, the current transformer sockets. Right next to it, the RS485 termination switch. At the top right, the RS485 socket. Finally, at the bottom right on the side, the Modbus ID switches. Now, let's move into the installation itself. Connect the meter to the DIN rail adapters and fasten them using the supplied screws. Make sure they are firmly screwed. Next, mount the DIN rail in the electric cabinet, or alternatively on a dry wall or wood surface. Turn off AC power before clamping on current transformers. Now, clamp the current transformers with the arrows pointing to the grid for consumption or export and import measurement. Then, connect the CT wires to the three two-pin terminal blocks on the meter. Note that the, the black and white CT wires should be connected according to the dots printed on the terminal block. Next, pull out the RS485 connector located on the communication board. Then, connect the RS485 wires to the A and B terminals, and connect the shield to the G terminal. Now, connect the voltage phases wires to the meter. Make sure they correlate to the correct phase. Finally, turn on the AC power. That's it. The meter is installed. To configure the meter, please watch our meter configuration video on our YouTube channel or on our website.